Yeah, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, Glorio. And he is still ordering food. Oh, let's go. Damn, tossed his ass with a hamburger in his mouth. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Ooch. I'm here with my brother, Ooch. And we are back again. Once again. How y'all doing today? What's up, everybody? Episode 3, Dragon Ball Daima. I uh, was able to manage to record this a little sooner because I guess bless Call of Duty because that's the only way this guy was going to be here early. And also, send your well wishes to Crystal. She wasn't feeling too great. So that's why she's not here with us for this episode. So hope you're feeling better. And I'm, I'm going to be checking on you right after that. I'm done recording this anyway. So I heard that this episode has got action. Yeah. I saw a couple preview images. <clears throat> if you were paying attention on the social media, you'll know. I shared that on my Twitter, so make sure you guys are following and all that good stuff. Without further ado, let's just get right into it. Damn, this intro is kind of sick. Ooh. Okay, so I'm guessing this is just going to be a part of the the, the opening intro now. That's pretty dope. Warp Sama. That's the I think that's the fish. What the heck? Have we ever heard of that planet? I don't think so. Nope. <laughs> that looks like a big waffle planet. <laughs> that is. Straight up planet Belgium is what they should have called it. Mm. Okay, so these are like the little destinations on how they can transfer over to the demon realm. Yeah. It's like these warp points. Warp samas are sensitive. Huh. Oh my god, Goku. Oh, he lying. He's saying they're from the demon realm. Hmm. Oh, he's covering his ear. Oh, that was smart. <laughs> I'm telling you, I think we're onto something with these theories we've been making on the podcast. 8821, that's the passcode. Remember that, folks. That's crazy. They really do have to go through that every time they got to pass through. That sucks. <laughs> That's insane. That is wild. <laughs> that reminds me of how the Pokemon characters used to look. Remember? Yeah. Demon Realm is divided into three worlds. Okay. Mm. So the first one is for palace members only. Dude, this is a freaking JRPG 100%. They got to get through each level mm -hmm. starting from the bottom. They should really just make this a video game at this point. Two. Like this is an RPG. That's actually crazy. All right, boys, we made it. Third Demon Realm. I wonder if they're gonna show that exact route when Vegeta and them come. Mm -hmm. I kind of hope not. Right. <laughs> I kind of hope they just fucking they get right to it. Yeah, they just pop out. Oh, he couldn't tell Kibito the pin number. That's why he was bugging out before. That actually reminds me of something I literally recently saw out of Hunter Hunter. I've been watching that. Oh, so beyond that is the different worlds. Damn. So someone made this locked. Interesting. Yeah, so how can you use it? He must have been shunned. Oh. Oh. Oh, he being sus. He said this and that. Okay. Glorio. Oh, damn, look at that. Yo, freaking Dabro got a statue. But that must mean they got they have to have an Aburo one, right? For his dad? His pops? Maybe. Alright, we're finally setting foot on the third wor world in the demon realm. Let's get it. Oh no, the gravity is different here. Gonna have to get used to that shit. Well, you know what? That's only gonna make him stronger yeah. in the long term. And you know what? This is only gonna piss off the Vegeta fans more because now Goku has an up on him even here. Because <laughs> he's there first. Exactly. So he gets to get used to it faster. The Sea of Darkness. Man, you just perish instantly, huh? Someone must have cursed all this shit up. Ooh, who we scrapping against? Goblin? Yeah, Goblin Slayer. Halfway already. That makes sense. Man, how are they gonna show her? And she not. She having, what? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, okay. Oos! Whooped out the gat! Damn, that's a crazy looking turtle. So these floating islands are literally just floating volcanoes. That's insane. <laughs> Goku farted. That's crazy. They already got this man passing gas. I feel like they're going to get into some trouble. 
thirty thousand. Damn, that sounds like a lot. Showed him the piece. So they got hunt hamburgers in the demon realm. Okay. Damn, why did it get so quiet all of a sudden? <laughs> I'll take five. Jeez, menacing. Uh oh. Don't ask what kind of meat that is. Yeah, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, Glorio. And he is still ordering food. Oh, let's go. Damn, tossed his ass with a hamburger in his mouth. And he's still eating. Oh, he's, he's stretching up real quick. He's getting used to it now. Oh my god, this dude's gonna pull out an axe? He can't even get it out the ground now. This is basically practice for Goku right now. Mm -hmm. I can't believe Goku is really doing this right now. Eating while fighting. Eating while fighting. He still mm -hmm. wants more. Yo, what is what is Goku's thing with having his foot on somebody when he sleeps? Hey man, that's a thing. That's a, clearly a thing for him. So they're probably gonna go get some reinforcements is what I'm guessing. Maybe. I, I feel like they're gonna be back. Damn, Gloria was just waiting for them outside the <laughs> door. <gasps> no way, they stole his plane. That's crazy. All right, what does that say? Don't tell me this is how the episode ends. Oh my god, these cliffhangers, man. Oh, man. So, I did want to say, during this uh, outro, there's a part that we had mentioned, for, I think from last week, when we were asking, I wonder what the significance of that bird is. That's actually just a direct shout out to Akira Toriyama himself. And the in the lyrics, Akira Toriyama are all part of the lyrics so that's never happened in the history of like any other anime ever where they shouted out the creator the original creator in a direct way which is really nice mm. so this part right here oh hold on damn we oh okay all right so the the good thing with this is at least we are getting more action to go along with the progression of the story. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I know it's, it's like, not a it's lot. Like, it's like baby action. Yeah, <sighs> yeah I know. It's, it's what we got right now. It's what it is. It's, gonna, it's probably not gonna be, I wanna say, until the closer we get to double digits, that's probably when we're really gonna see some more action right now I'm, I'm not gonna lie it's 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 very slow i'm gonna give them two episodes to get vegeta and all the other in demon world okay if it's if it passes two ep two more episodes and no you, vegeta you already know they have some bullshit with the timing well we don't even know how many episodes this is gonna end up being i thought it was supposed to be like 20. yeah well that was like the original speculation but it was i mean shit if it's shorter fuck. no it might be longer oh fuck. <laughs> Well, as always, guys, let us know what you guys thought about this week's episode of Dragon Ball Dima Episode 3. And also keep in mind, you can go check Fathom.com. Not a sponsor, but I figured I'd just let y'all know that you can actually go and see the first three episodes in theaters at participating theaters. You got to check FathomEvents.com. I think is the, the website. I'll include a link to the description. I already got my tickets to go see the first three episodes in English. So you get to hear Stephanie Nadolny's performance as uh, Goku Mini in this uh new series and i'm sure it'll be nice to hear what it sounds like in english but to to experience all this in a big screen i love watching anime in, in movies take care of yourselves may the proper tech keep locked with right here on this channel stay safe stay clean and stay the hell inside and we'll see y'all next time